anyone can do something extraordinary. Anyone can change the world. You just have to ask yourself one question. Why not me? Brian began to ask this question, why not me, after attending Hobie, New Jersey and the World Leadership Congress. Soon after, he applied to become a journalist for his local paper. Only a year later, his stories would make the cover. Brian also began his career in politics at a young age, running a successful campaign to elect his friend to the local school board while still in high school. So Brian turned to me and he said, Kenny, you should run for the board today. Think about it. You know what we need as students. You were just there. And I said, Brian, no one's ever going to vote for someone who's 19 years old. They're definitely not voting for me. And Brian turned to me and said, Kenny, think about it. You would be our principal boss. And I looked at Brian and I said, where is the application? This success launched Brian's political career, where he worked for NBA Hall of Famer and Senator Bill Bradley, Delaware Governor and Senator Tom Carper, and as Delaware Governor Jack Markell's Chief Strategy Officer. Brian is the greatest Hobie advocate that I know. And I'm not surprised because he represents all of the values that Hobie holds dear. He was mature beyond his years, and he is a good example that age is only a number. I've enjoyed Brian's friendship for a decade. I've known him as someone who's committed to positive public purposes, who's helped grow successful campaigns for our Senator Tom Carper and Governor Jack Markell, and helped lead Governor Markell's administration. And I, for one, would not be governor of Delaware were it not for Brian, his advocacy, his leadership, his mentorship, and his friendship. After advice from Governor Markell, Brian realized his potential for the private sector, helping to build an award-winning corporation and becoming an executive in another multi-billion dollar firm. After a successful career in these corporations and with Governor Markell, Brian joined with his friend John West to create the newest innovation in the sports industry, Whistle Sports. Whistle Sports is a sensation in youth athletics with over 66 million subscribers. Brian is a game changer and at Whistle Sports really that's our view of what the youth generation is doing today and can do to the world um, beyond just media and Brian has really helped explain Whistle Sports to the world in a way uh, and make us relevant to our um, young millennial global uh, audience in a way that I don't think anybody would be able to so I'm blessed to be I've had the 10 years to work with Brian and hope we do it for another time. But Brian's greatest achievement is inspiring the next generation of leaders to also ask, why not me? By speaking at Hobie seminars nationwide, Brian has become one of the nation's greatest advocates for youth leadership. Countless young leaders look up to Brian as a positive role model. I first met Brian almost 10 years ago when I was just a 15 year old kid attending Hobie. He's been an amazing mentor and friend of mine. In just a few days, he had put me in touch with now Governor Jack Markell's campaign for treasurer and got me an internship. I always think to myself, why not me? That little phrase echoes in my head and it's all because of Brian. Congratulations, Brian. You've done a great job, Brian. And for all of you at Hobie, you've made a great pick. Brian, congratulations. You deserve this. Congratulations again. Good luck in all that lies ahead. You're truly outstanding.